Vice President Lai Qingde is on a flight to San Francisco after attending the inauguration ceremony of Paraguay's president, Santiago Peña. Before leaving Paraguay, Lai held a gathering for local media. He took questions on a wide array of topics, including whether Washington trusts him and whom he might pick for running mate. Before leaving Paraguay, Vice President Lai Qingde held a press event. A reporter brought up his low-key U.S. transit, how China still saw fit to make threats and launch large-scale military exercises in the East China Sea. Could the PRC's warmongering be an attempt to intervene in Taiwan's upcoming election? That is all in line with international media reports that say China is attempting to interfere with Taiwan's election through military threats. If on top of that we have collaborators that work for China and Taiwan, of course they will try to sway the election's outcome to align with China's interests. It's not good at all, but I'm very confident in the people of our country. China has been making big moves in the region. Meanwhile, in Taiwan, opposition parties have argued that Lai's low-key transit shows that the U.S. doesn't trust him. Whether it's casting doubt on me or on the U.S.'s support for Taiwan, all of that is Chinese propaganda. Their goal is to undermine our relations with the U.S. This also serves to create misconceptions in Taiwanese society and ultimately influence next year's presidential and legislative elections. I have reiterated on many occasions that I will defend Taiwan's sovereignty. Lai said Beijing was trying to influence Taiwan's elections with disinformation. During his first U.S. transit, Lai was joined at all times by Taiwan's representative to Washington, Xiaobi Kim. On social media, he posted a photo of the two of them watching a game at the City Field Baseball Stadium. Rumors are running high that Xiao could be tapped for Lai's running mate. This time around, I came to Taiwan as a special envoy for President Tsai Ing-wen. My mission was very clear. The purpose of this trip is unrelated to the election, so naturally I did not discuss electoral matters with Xiao Bi Kim. Lai fielded sensitive questions but shied away from discussing his campaign, saying he wanted the focus to stay on Paraguay.